evasion successful. Reapers eluded. Dig up any information on the mission, Lyra? I did, and I now understand why High Command wanted to hide it. We're headed to an Ardat Yakshi monastery. Ardat Yakshi? Like Morinth? Morinth chose to be a killer. These Ardat Yakshi isolated themselves to avoid that. But it doesn't mean they're harmless. Their urge to feed can be powerful. That's why High Command sent in commandos to investigate the monastery's distress signal. That is less than encouraging. What were the commandos' orders? If there was a chance the Ardat Yakshi could break loose, the commandos were to purge the monastery. Purge? You mean destroy? They would have brought heavy explosives with them, yes. Morinth was dangerous, but are the Ardat Yakshi this big of a threat? Morinth was just hitting her stride. Ardat Yakshi who kill leave behind astronomical body counts. It's why they can never be free and why they're such a great source of shame to the Asari. That's why High Command won't rest until this place is destroyed. They'd never risk a single Ardat Yakshi getting loose. We don't need something that dangerous running around during a war. We locate the commandos, then finish the job. As you wish. Though I'd like to know exactly who sent the distress call. We'll find out soon enough. Elevator disabled. To prevent entry or escape, I wonder. That vocalization exceeds Asari's vocal cord range. <clears throat> As do those. What was that? Stay sharp. This was the Commando's captain. It seems they gave their lives fighting the Reapers. This monastery's out of the way. What do the Reapers want with Ardat Yakshi? Anything useful? A floor plan marked with a nav point location for a bomb. It's planted inside the monastery's great hall. So the Commando's started the purge after all. This place is a lost cause if it's already crawling with Reapers. Let's get to the Great Hall and set off that bomb.
Sophia Vanya. Meet us after supper in the library. Brings her study work. Real is floor warden tonight, so act natural. We'll be by the East Video Banks. This is gonna be so great. See you there. Oh, and delete this once you listen to it. Not like last time. I heard something. That was my fault, sorry. Very good. I almost didn't hear you. Samara? It has been some time, Shepard. You are a most welcome sight. The corruption here runs deep. I assume you're here on your own, Justicar. Perhaps for something special? You are correct. Two of my daughters live here. And I have come for them. Unfortunately, the Reapers had already invested this place by the time I arrived. You met me hunting down your other Ardat Yakshi daughter. Are these ones just as dangerous? Valer and Rila have followed the Monastery's rules ever since they arrived. They've shown no inclination toward violence. And you're here to save them? They are my responsibility. And it's one that cannot be abandoned even as our galaxy crumbles. Let's go together. Maybe your daughters can tell us why the Reapers hit this place. I suspect they will have much to tell us. It has been centuries since I last saw them. We're out of time. We'll meet again. I will draw these creatures off. Wait! Let's go. My name is Tashia Pore. I'm wounded. Bad. Give this to my bondmate, Weshra. Asked her to go to the Citadel and tell Weshra I love her. Tell her. Sorry we fought. I was an idiot. Didn't mean any of it, Weshra. What? Want you to have everything of mine, okay? Love you. I love you so. <gasps> this was likely the Reaper's initial attack site. Think the monastery got any warning? Few signs of resistance. I'd say very little warning.
used to be a person, an Asari. What have the Reapers done? As soon as I was able. Shepard, this is Faler, my youngest. She and her sister Rila are Ardat Yakshi. They have Mother, been... they have Rila! What? I saw some of those creatures take her into the Great Hall. I've been trying to get there. What are the Reapers doing here? Harvesting us. They're turning us into... into those... monsters. Please, you can't let that happen to Rila. The Asari thought the Ardat Yakshi were to blame for the attack. This is our home. Most of us are grateful to be here. The monastery is a place Ardat Yakshi can achieve peace. Valer speaks truthfully, Shepard. I vouch for her words, with pride. Then we have to find Rila fast. The Great Hall has a bomb in it. A bomb? But didn't you come to rescue people? We'll try, but we can't leave this place standing, Valer. You sound like the Commandos. They didn't stop to help anyone. Valer? I'm sorry. The Great Hall. She's looking for Rila. We'll meet you there. Please be swift. You'd need a crowbar to pry those doors open. This place was beautiful before the Reapers came.
found another Asari commando, also deceased. Falaire and her sister may be the only survivors. Yes. I was unsure if it was appropriate to broach the subject. Thank you, Edie. But don't spare my feelings. It's better to know. appears intact. So does Falaire. Rila. Rila, wake up. Falaire. Rila cannot hear us. Look, she's still alive. I know, but I am afraid Rila is not well. Rila's not one of them yet. She can't be. She just needs to wake up. Rila? Rila, can you hear me? she do that? Because they've begun to turn her into one of the Reaper's creatures. I'm sorry. Can we set off that bomb? The explosives require a detonator. The commandos would have had one. We've got to find it. Later. One. For now, let's get back to that bomb. Solaire, go! Take the elevator! Rila, what, what are you doing? 
It's too late for me. There are hundreds coming. Just go! Move! No! Rila! I love you. Rila! It wasn't even time to say goodbye. Few can break the Reaper's hold. Rila's will was extraordinary, as was her love for you. We left her to die. Rila made her choice, and it has reminded me of what is truly important. Why I swore I'd lay down my life. What is that? Alair, the code demands an Ardat Yakshi cannot live outside a monastery that no longer exists. What are you doing? I'm sorry, Shepard. By the Justicar's code, there is only one way to save Alair. Mother, no! My daughters, you were all so much stronger than I... Let. Go. What are you doing? Fulfilling the code. By throwing your life away? I won't kill my last daughter. You won't have to. Valer? I'll stay here. Home. No matter what's become of it. Without a proper monastery, I could have left any time. I don't need a building to honor my own code. And if the Reapers return, they won't take me alive. I promise. Then, the code permits you to stay, as you are. Once this war is over, and if I am able, I will visit, as a Justicar should. I meant it when I said the galaxy needs you against the Reapers. You were right. It's past time I joined your battle. I'll fight in your armies, Shepard, once I speak with Falaire. I'll be waiting. Not for long. Thank you, my friend. Everything's taken care of down here. Bring in the shuttle. Right, Commander. I'll just follow the smoke. Commander, are the Ardot Yakshi finally taken care of? They won't be a problem anymore. Good. We don't need further distractions. How's Thessia's evacuation? Slow. We've... we've saved fewer people than I'd hoped. We'll send Admiral Hackett any commanders we can spare. I must go. Commander, Admiral Hackett's available on VidCon. Commander, 
Something on your mind? What's our state of readiness, Admiral? We're getting there. And with the Reapers pressing their advantage across all fronts, we don't have a lot of time to catch up. What about the extra help we picked up along the way? It's a testament to your efforts that even with everyone's back to the wall, they're still honoring their commitments. Bringing in both the Quarians and the Geth has helped us immeasurably. The Quarian fleet is providing evac and fire support, while the Geth attack Reaper supply lines. What's the Reaper situation? As you know, the Asari homeward fell. The Turians are under heavy siege and probably won't hold out. Same goes for the Krogan. The Salarians are putting up a spirit of defense. Not sure how long that can last. The Shrike Abyssal, Celia Nebula, Ethan Cluster, Hades Gamma, all in trouble. We're losing the galaxy fast, Shepard. Nothing more, sir. Hack it out. Got new messages, Commander. Signal confirmed. something.
about 72 hours ago, the reactors at a joint Turin Asari fuel depot went offline. Scans at the station are cold. It's deserted. What happened to the troop station there? Unknown, but no fuel means no fleet presence in this theater. The enemy will operate unchecked. I need you to get in there, find out what's going on, and get those reactors back online. Captain Riley's on site doing preliminary recon. She leads one of our top engineering teams. We'll get to the bottom of this, Admiral. Good. Hack it out. Commander, Corporal Nyrek reporting. Captain Riley is on point waiting for you. How long have you served in this outfit, Corporal? Three tours. Been through thick and thicker. The Captain always sees us through. Confirming. Toxic radiation cutting access to most of the grid. Survival in hotspots, not possible. We need a radiation workaround, soldier. Captain Riley? Commander, it's an honor. Commander, Captain Riley has me scanning the facility. It's a dual reactor system, so you'll have to break up into two teams. Roger that. The fuel rods for both reactors need to be unlocked before we can initiate a restart. Your route is blocked. Captain Riley's man is working to clear the obstacles. Understood, Lieutenant. Got it, Captain. Good work, Coslo. I'll take it from here. Ready your team to hit reactor two, Captain. Got it. We'll cover you till you're clear. Same situation here. I'll find a way to vent the area. This looks like ventilation control. Should do the trick. Radiation clearing. Console now accessible. Let's unlock those fuel rods.
tight. One of my people is coming. Roger that. Ash, you're on. You got it. Job well done. Report back to the shuttles. Good work down there, Shepard. Without that depot, the entire theater would be at risk. What are the odds the Reapers will be back? I'm allocating a task force to maintain and defend the facility. If the Reapers come back, we'll be ready. I read Captain Raleigh's report. It says she and her team wouldn't have made it without you. I'm glad I could help. I'll keep you posted on new developments. Hack it out. Commander? Signal confirmed. Faster than light jump successful. I found something. Asian successful. Signal confirmed. Reapers eluded.
smell something. than light jump successful. Evasion successful. Reapers eluded. You're cleared to dock, Normandy. Do you need ground transport? I'll handle it. Yes, Commander. I'd like to request a transfer to a zone with Reaper, Sergeant. And may I ask why you think your deployment deserves special treatment, Private? Status recognized. One moment, please. Now arriving at docking bay E24, emergency civilian housing. Are you okay? I've just been standing here holding this for I don't know how long. He'll always be a part of me. Your past is yours. No one can take that away. I love you, but I know you. Don't make me an anchor. Promise me, Steve. Goodbye, Robert. I'm glad you came. Recognized. One moment, please. Now arriving at Presidium Embassy. Was the Volus ambassador here earlier? Yes, he was, Commander. I need in. Spectre business. I'll unlock the office when you're ready. with us before, Ambassador. That's because you were actually doing some good in the galaxy before. Has that changed? How many colonies would be gone if we hadn't taken action against the Collectors? Too many. But fighting the Alliance... 
must continue in order to end the war. We understand it took a lot for you to reach out to Cerberus, Ambassador Korlak. We ask that you trust us a little longer. You people are monsters! Ambassador, please. Hundreds dead. Udina betraying the Council. I should have cut ties with you ages ago. And what will that accomplish now? The risks you took by passing information to Cerberus. It's left you in an interesting position. If you sever contact, we can't protect you from the consequences. I don't... I have no time for this. We'll speak again. Have a good day, Ambassador Korlak. The Turians think I'm still working for Cerberus. They've put a price on my head. I can't go to CSEC, but Cerberus has plans. An entire Turian colony rests on my life. If anyone finds this, I hid a tracking receiver in the office suite beside the human embassies. has them everywhere nowadays. You gonna go on about them all night? Just get the car up here quick. Little bastard's even heavier than he looks. Zaid? This is Commander Shepard. Can you hear me? Yes. Yes, I can hear you. Tell me where you are. Uh, we're still near the Presidium. CSEC will check Selkish arms when they realize I'm missing. They won't give a damn when they realize you sold them out to Cerberus. Wait. Cerberus is planning to attack a colony that... Stay calm. Help's coming. Now arrive Zaid used to work for Cerberus. Ask him why. Why? Why go after your old employer, Zaid? Now you know my name, all of a sudden. Good question. Please visit any of our Elkos Combine affiliate branches for any and all personal needs. Damn, wrong door. He needs you alive to stop Cerberus. Cerberus is after a Turian colony. Kill me, and they get it. 
drop by name. Shepard's investigating. He's a recent acquaintance. How recent? I got your message, Miranda. Is this about your sister? Shepard, I need access to Alliance resources. I can't say any more. You'll just have to trust me. I don't like secrets, Miranda. Just tell me what's going on. I can't, Shepard. If that's a problem, I'll go. Don't. Trust is a little hard to come by right now. Of course. You'll have your access, Miranda, but I don't like the sound of this. I know, and thank you. It means a lot. That's not the only thing you wanted to talk about, is it? No. I need to tell you something. Confess, really. It's been eating away at me. Confess? <laughs> When I headed the Lazarus Project to rebuild you, I wanted to implant a control chip in you as a safeguard. I think you mentioned this. I did. There's more to it. The elusive man stopped me. Sounds like it would have saved him a lot of trouble. Maybe. He didn't want to interfere with who you truly were. Something that just obeyed orders. He wanted Commander Shepard. Installing the chip might have ruined you. I'm glad you didn't. Better to stay dead than be someone's plaything. Exactly. Why bring that up now? I fought against my father and his need to run every aspect of my life. He wanted total control over me, right down to my bloody DNA. After I got out of there, I couldn't stand by and let it happen to my sister. I risked my life to get her away from all that. Yet I didn't give a second thought to destroying your free will when I had the power. This is what's been bothering you? Yes. Miranda, I lost two years of my life. You gave me back the rest of it. You could have taken everything from me, made me a prisoner. But you didn't. I don't know how. You brought me back. Thanks. But with so much being uncertain, I just wanted you to know I always regretted wanting that chip. You can't keep beating yourself up over the past. I usually don't. But this was important. Some things you just don't have control over. Guess my fancy genetics can't help me there. No. They can't. Okay. I hate to say it, but I should get moving. Thanks for understanding, Shepard. Of course. And Miranda, this thing you have to do, good luck. Don't worry, Shepard. I always have a plan. Been a while, Zaid. Shepard. Glad I wasn't just making an ass of myself over a hunch. Undisciplined bastards. This is what I get for signing up at the last minute. Where's Korlak? I'm here, Commander. I... You saved my life. I almost died because the Turians thought I was still with Cerberus. You should have gone to CSEC if your life was in danger. And be thrown into prison? No. The things they would do to me after the damage I caused. What intel did you give Cerberus on this colony? Information on a Turian planet's defense system. They'll strike soon. But if I tell you which planet they're attacking, Cerberus will know I turned traitor. Turn? You already betrayed your own people. We saved your life. Tell us what planet you put in danger. I can offer a bargain. The Volus bombing fleet. In tactical terms, it's worth far more than a colony. Or you could give us both. You can warn the Turians there'll be an attack, Commander. That should be general enough to ward off suspicion. All right. I tried playing nice. Maybe my friend can get you to see reason. Now wait just a moment. You mind, Zaid? It'd be a goddamn pleasure.
I'll leave you to it. It'll be a while before anyone shows up for him. It's Aphis. Cerberus will attack a colony called Aphis for its shipyards. And the bombing fleet? Take it. It's all yours, I promise. I'll speak with Citadel security about this... incident. You have my thanks. Took him long enough to spit that out. Zaid, what are you doing here? Later. c sex on their way. Won't be too pleased with the mess we left them. Catch up with me at the docks if you like. This is a nice spot, Ash. Yeah. All the shuttles zipping around remind me of when my dad would get ready to ship out. My mom would bundle us all up, buy us ice cream, and cart us out to the shipyard to watch his transport depart. I still have to resist waving every time a big Alliance ship flies by. You should bring Sarah up here. I will, when she's ready. She'll like the quiet. She wasn't the loud tomboy crashing around like I was. Sounds like you were a handful. Maybe. My dad got me. Shame you never met him. He would have liked you. You think so? Career military man? Yeah. Yeah, he would have invited you over, cooked you something on the grill, and talked your ear off. Ever think about what life would have been like outside the Alliance? Oh, sure. Tried to rebel against the whole military family thing when I was growing up. When my dad and I got into it, I'd threaten to run away with the next guy that came along. Really? He'd laugh and say, Good, I'll pack your damn bags myself. That tended to deflate me pretty quick. He knew I'd never stray far from the family. They're everything to me. It's easy to forget what we fight for. Yeah, moments like that. This was a good idea. Nice to get away from the war for a while. I do feel a little guilty, though. Sure. But sometimes you have to step away or risk going crazy. Too late. No argument here. You're a crappy commander. You're a crappy commander... Sir. Copy that. Her name is... Weshra, I have an audio log for you. For me? Where did this come? Oh, no. Oh, Tasha. Thank you for bringing this back. At least I know what happened. Sure you don't want to do something a little more exciting? I love this part of the Presidium. It reminds me of where I grew up. Where's that? Armali, back on Thessia. My mother and I lived beside a park. I spent hours there. Doing what? Reading, exploring. I thought it was the most beautiful place in the world. It must be gone now. I wish you could have seen it. I bet it was something special. I don't know. I hadn't seen it in 40 years. My mother always thought we would visit. I miss her, Shepard. I'd question your character if you didn't. I suppose. I don't often talk about it. Hey, you'll stop grieving when you want to. Strangely, that's comforting. Thank you, Shepard. I wish we could spend more time together like this. Just...
friends. And it'd be nice. And who knows? Maybe you'll settle down after this. You don't really see me going into civilian life, do you? No. But I guess that's one more reason we should keep in touch. Someone to share a few secrets with now and then? You got it.